Hi everyone, my name is Richie Hoagland and I'm the CEO of Ralph ER. At Ralph ER, we're connecting people through unforgettable adventures. Our world is turning digital. Our books and our walls are turning into screens. As more of our lives enter into this digital realm, products such as Facebook and Twitter have arisen to keep us connected with our friends and family. Unfortunately, current social media and technology fails us to give us the connected social experience that we require as social beings. The kind of experience we get when we're sitting in a room with another person. Virtual reality has the potential to solve this problem. I like to call virtual reality the social component of the digital world. And at Ralph VR, we're giving people back this connected social experience through virtual reality. Now, it's hard to convey what this is like until you experience it firsthand. But I can tell you what it was like for me, sitting in a hotel room in China with my co-founder in California and our friend in Kentucky. We were testing our product Daydream Blue's multiplayer functionality. And while thousands of miles separated our physical bodies, to me, I was standing near feet from my friends, laughing and joking over the fire. So let me introduce you to the team that's making this a reality. I myself have been making games for 10 years. I made games for kids, I made games for education, and I made games for hardcore gamers. My co-founder, Shay, has made games for a number of devices, mobile, PC, console, and now virtual reality. And our producer, Jeff, has produced content for National Geographic and Discover Communications, reaching millions of viewers. We also have some amazing mentors. We just brought on Martin Amore, who's former CTO of AAA game studio, IO Interactive. And as a team, we're alumni of the Silicon Valley Incubator Boost VC. And we're thrilled to be a part of the Awesome Inc. Fellowship Program. Let me introduce you to our first product, Daydream Blue, a multiplayer game for everyone. In Daydream Blue, no matter where you are or what time it is, you can enter your own personal valley to relax, play games, hang out with your robot pal, or connect with others. Daydream Blue got started as gold winner in the Oculus Mobile VR Jam last year. That was out of thousands of participants and netted us a $100,000 cash prize. Daydream Blue was the first game on consumer virtual reality devices supporting multiplayer and positional voice chat. And as you can see in this image, we're early developers on Google's Daydream platform. To date, we have 3,000 users in Daydream Blue. Those are paid users. We just launched on our second device, the Oculus Rift, last week. And in April of this year, we launched version 1.0 of our multiplayer technology. And that gave users avatars, friends lists, and the ability to invite people to play the game. Moving forward, we're gonna put Daydream Blue on four virtual reality devices by the end of this year. And we're gonna continue developing our multiplayer technology. It's our competitive advantage as a game studio. Now I'd like to share this quote from Mark Zuckerberg, where he says, virtual reality is really a new communications platform. Imagine sharing not just moments online with your friends, but entire experiences and adventures. We agree. At Ralph VR, we create multiplayer worlds people share and explore with others. So I'd like to share with you a tweet from late last year. Just spent an hour hanging out in VR with my sister, who lives a thousand miles away, in Daydream Blue. This embodies what we're building as a studio and the way we're connecting people together. At Ralph VR, we're connecting people through unforgettable adventures. Thank you.